Hi. Mac. So I've officially crashed back on Earth and I'm ready to be chaotic again. Hello. Hi. What's up? I know I am late on this. Okay. But also, y'all move way too fast nowadays. I know. This topic has been a topic for a few weeks. I am aware. I am like almost a month late. But girl, I have a very big reason. A very reasonable reason why. I had no fucking clue what was going on until three days ago. You're welcome. <laughs> I look like the type of person that is following every single ounce of tea on the fucking internet at all fucking times. No. For the past few weeks, I have been getting a bunch of tweets. What is your response to this? What do you think of this, Mac? What do you think of this, Mac? What do you think of this, Mac? Until I finally answered, girl, I don't fucking know what's happening. I have been too busy watching Manifest on Netflix and drinking a lot of fucking wine. Okay. But now we're here. And now I'm aware. And now I'm ready to do something stupid. <laughs> After watching some of my friends' videos, I am now fully aware of the full Colleen Ballard situation. But I have yet to watch the ukulele video that she has put out and I refuse to watch it in its entirety. Because the amount of secondhand embarrassment I get from just watching snippets of it on Twitter like literally shakes me to my fucking core. But instead of watching it and reacting to it like everyone else has on this internet, I'm going to take it a bit of a step up. I love me some cursed edits and remakes on the internet. You know I love getting my groove on to the most cursed fucking thing. And you also probably saw the title of this fucking video, but you can place this all together now. I am not going to watch the original ukulele video, but instead we're going to watch a shit ton of remixes and edits of the original video and rank them based on which one I like the best. But I'm also going to state my opinions at the so end. So keep on watching, you know, I want that Retention time. That's right, kitty. This is both a reacting video and a ranking video. Oh my fucking god. Someone call. Oh, what? And this is my tier list. Carlina Jura Balagiana remix tier list. You're welcome. And these are my tiers. And they are all respectively labeled based on lines from my favorite rap song from my favorite queen of rap, Nicki Minaj. Feeling myself. First tier? Yes, daddy, I do. That's top nut. Top crunch. Top curse. Or anything that has cupcake in it, okay? I'm a simple girl. Second tier. Give me brain like NYU. So not daddy top tier. But it's still head. So like it's it's there. And then we have Today I'm icy. But I'm praying for some more snow. Y'all you know what that means, okay? It's good, but we can do more. And then we have bitches ain't got punchlines or flow. Y'all know what the fuck that means. It's off. It's missing the mark. You know, it was an attempt, but the attempt was subpar. Okay? And I deep dive for these remixes. Some of these only have, I think, like 92 views. And girl, we're about to give it 93. <laughs> and last tier, bottom tier, bottom of the barrel. Why these bitches okay. don't never be learning? The bitch didn't learn, you know? It was flat. It was trash. Can't even do better. Can't even improve. Just throw it away. You know what I mean? So the very first one is... Hi. Toxic Gossip Train Night Court. I don't know what the fuck Night Court is, but if it's something terrifying, I... I will literally stop recording this video. Give it to me. What's happening? She did not do the beginning side. She did not do the fucking beginning side. Like every fucking YouTuber does the beginning. There's apology videos. Oh my god. Literally stage one manipulation. You have to understand that these YouTubers edit their own fucking shit when they do that. She purposely kept in the side and beginning of the video. God. Watch any YouTuber like apologizing or having to do a serious fucking video. Serious fucking video. They always start with a fucking sigh. I think I even did it too, girl. I'm not even. I'm not even above it. I've been a while since I saw my face. Oh, it's just sped up. Sped up. All aboard! Toxic gossip train. Chatting down the tracks of misinformation. Toxic gossip train. Come over it. Oh, this is gonna be a weird video. So this remix is just sped up, right? I don't want to watch the fucking video, okay? I don't want to watch just the original shit. I want a real remix, okay? I've heard the highlights. I don't need to hear the rest. And the fact that she starts the video. Oh, are you guys having fun? Yeah, you guys having fun with all the rumors, girl? Gas lighter. I'm gonna go to the most replayed section and see if it changed. The only thing I've ever groomed is my two Persian cats. Oh. Not oh. Just a loser. Okay. I forgot she fucking says that. I forgot she fucking says that. I forgot that part. Oh my god. Nightcore toxic gossip train. We just never be learning, okay? I'm sorry. You didn't give me enough curse. You didn't give me enough crunch. So you have to sit back, okay? Now, I didn't make the rules. Except I did make the rules. So shut the fuck up. <laughs> Paulina Nama. Ballerina Nama. Fan edit. Toxic gossip train. With a thumbnail that says, We heart your grooming Colleen. So I'm expecting this to be insanely cursed. Aside, picking up the youth. 
All this. All that could have been edited out. You turned the situation into theater at that point. You gave us an opening. And it's been a while since I saw my face. I've been all over the internet for nearly a month for grooming fans into doing free labor and having sexual combos. Okay. You guys having fun? Staring at the camera. The pauses. The breath. The rehearsal. She had to rehearse this. This is not really a remix. So this person's just posting receipts and responses to everything she said. Okay. Great. Don't want to finish that. <laughs> Bitches ain't got punchlines or flow. Okay. There was no punchlines or flow, but there was come. So, congrats. I didn't do shit. I am so perfect. I remade Colleen Ballinger's apology video the right way. One minute and 27 seconds long. We're moving now. The sign. Grab the ukulele. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh. Yes. All yes. aboard the toxic gossip train. Okay. That scared the shit out of me. <laughs> but it's what I'm talking about, girl. Give me the curse. Chugging down the tracks of. Yeah. <laughs> this is what I mean, okay? This is my type of YouTube content. Toxic gossip train. Yes. Yes. Rumors look like facts. If you don't mind the gaps, I won't survive. Oh my god. Oh. oh. Yep. Yes. 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 How are you sealing? Toxic gossip train. Okay. Locomotives fueled with hateful accusations. Toxic gossip train. Yeah. Perfect. That's what I want to see. That's what I want to hear. Crunchy. All aboard! Bitch, we're into it. That is our first official yes daddy I do. If I've ever seen one myself, that is what I expect of every single one of you. Okay, I'm not mad, I'm just disappointed. Dubstep Remix. By Sarah Bascop? Sarah! Sarah. Dubstep Remix by Sarah Fa- Ooh, It's French. Look it up, okay? Paris Fashion Week. All aboard. All aboard. All aboard. All aboard. All aboard, bitch. All aboard. Okay. Okay. All aboard. Hey. Hey. It's been a while since I saw my face. We've seen you the entire past month. Not a groomer. Just a loser. Coachella DJ set list. I'll show up. I'll show up, girly. It got my blood pumping. It was litty. But you know what, Sarah? Sarah, listen to me. I'm gonna act like you watch my videos. You don't watch my videos. You don't even know what the fuck I am, probably. Sarah, it was cute, but I was missing that crunch, okay? I prefer a crunch. Curse crunch to my internet remixes and internet edits, okay? As a professional on the internet, <laughs> we're going to give you brain like brain NYU, NYU, okay? I think you'll appreciate that. We got one video in almost every single tier so far. Look at us being cute and shit. Look at us being silly! Uh -huh. Okay, SpongeBob edit, here we go. Hey. Okay. Okay. It's been a while since you saw my face. Oh my god, does that sound like him? All aboard the toxic gossip train. <laughs> How do they- I swear to god, AI is terrifying. AI is the scariest thing that we have made. Do you know that we have created a thing called a quantum computer that looks like this? And we, to this day, have no full idea what it's fully capable of. That is right. Scientists have created a computer they do not know. It's full fucking ability. They created something that they are unsure what it can do. As in, it can do so much and create so much. They cannot keep track. What? 
What? Toxic gossip train. Toxic gossip train. We got train. one great victim to manipulation station. The rumors look like facts if you don't mind the gaps. So I hate it. Okay, I'm done. I know the SpongeBob AI thing is like top notch trending right now, but girl, I'm tired. Give me Patrick. Give him my love somewhere like you. Let's go to the most replayed section and see. The only thing I've ever grabbed oh, yeah. is my two okay. Persian cats. Why? Why? I'm just a loser. Why? I don't know. You know what? We're just gonna make it a clear line. We're gonna put you right in the middle. Today I'm icy, but I'm praying for some more snow. SpongeBob AI edit. They're the trend right now. They're icy, but I wish there was more to it. Okay? AI still scares me. Here we go. Height of luxury, motherfucker. This was automatically gonna be ten stars. I feel, I feel it in my bones. Charlie's apology video. Cupcake remix. Since I saw my Twat. a lot of people are saying some things about me that aren't quite what? Just as long as it's masturbating. Okay. As long as it's masturbating. All aboard the toxic pussy crane. The toxic pussy crane? The toxic pussy crane? Period. Let's go. The toxic pussy crane. We got a one way ticket. True. Time it to the beat and fuck me so good. Cause you look like twats if you don't mind. The bones I won't survive in the balls. But hey, at least you're having sex. Yeah! Hello, hello. <laughs> This is what I was waiting for, but it's 10 minutes longer. It's 10 minutes goddamn long. I've been wanting to suck that dick and talk to you. Okay. Even though my bitch has strongly advised me to not suck that dick till they come. Yep. I recently realized that they never said that I couldn't smack that ass like a drum. Yep. Period. They told me I have to slap that dick till it come. Didn't mean that I can't smack that ass like a drum. Fuck you. Today I only want to talk about the foreskin. So, okay. many years ago, I used to go up and down like a seesaw. Uh, but not in a creepy way, like a lot of you are trying to suggest. <laughs> but not in a creepy way! <laughs> I was just trying to be besties with everybody. Poppy! You were trying to be besties with it? I never heard that line. I did not hear that line until right now. See, I'm 26, and I use the term besties as funny and ironic. Because I'm 26. It's kind of like when you go to like a family threesome. Okay. You know, and there's a weird gay gap there. Okay. Coming up to you and going like, Oh my God, daddy, stop! And you're like, Ugh. Yeah, but you're not their aunt. You're not their family. You're not their relative. You're just a person that makes videos on the internet for those kids. I've been sharing my titties online for over 69 years. Me too. Heard my Come back to you, and because of that, I feel like I'm talking to Spider Man. But okay. there were times in the DMs when I would overshare details of my porn, which was really weird of me. Okay. I don't understand how she's like trying to act like it's just like a oopsie daisy when she was a full grown adult in her 30s doing this. Notably, talking to people under the age of 18. I cannot talk to someone under the age of 18 without feeling like I'm stepping into a different dimension. Okay? I don't know how she did it. What we gonna talk about, girl? Coco Melon? I don't fucking know. What do y'all want? You better not be fucking Euphoria. I swear to fucking God. Stay away from that, children. What do kids watch? What is that show about the superhero on Nickelodeon? What is the show? Mighty Sam? Mighty Sam? Henry Danger! I'ma just go. I'ma just leave. I'ma just leave. I'ma just leave, okay? I'm a full ass grown adult. I don't even know what the fuck Henry Danger is. Fuck you, I jump stay here. I've done that for years, you see, because I changed my bones two times a day. And I took a dick down my butt. But that's not very interesting. What? Toxic pussy brain. Squirt all over someone's wet vagina. Yes, this is ten minutes long. Talk about videos being so long when I make my videos like what 20 minutes. I want to go to the infamous part. The only thing I've ever groomed is my two Persian pussy. Yes, I'm not a smack, just a slipper. Put on a fucking shirt, girl. I didn't understand. I shouldn't fuck fans and I'm a predator. I'm a predator. It's your out the Obviously, yes, yes, 
daddy, I do. Cause we did. So I might have sent some underwear to somebody, but that's because I was trying to be a cool auntie. What kind of cool auntie sends underwear to somebody? This one could easily go so many different ways. Colleen Ballinger Apology Remix. Featuring Ice Spice. All aboard the toxic gossip hey. train. Hey. Chugging down the tracks hey. of misinformation. Hey. The toxic <laughs> gossip. Was that all Ice Spice's part? He's telling me that's all Ice Spice's part. That's all you have for her in there. Tracks of misinformation. <laughs> the toxic gossip train. Climb me to the tracks. <laughs> and harass me for my past. <laughs> Give me brain like NYU. Toxic Gossip Train. Colleen Ballinger Remix. I don't know what it's gonna sound like, but I'm scared. Ooh. Hey. Ooh. Hey. Oh. What? Hey. Oh. Hold on. Hold on. Period. Hey. 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 Right out the pink Lamborghini. The race with China, rock the way with China. I fucked it up. I fucked it. I'm sorry. I fucked it up. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Toxic. Hey. The only thing I've ever groomed is my two Persian cats. I hate that line so much. Where? Okay, we're going somewhere with these. That was also Yes Daddy I Do, okay? I like the beat. I like little stutters and all that stuff, girl. It was fully productionized. <laughs> this one is weird. I synced a roller coaster to Colleen Ballinger's apology. Oh, oh, the board, the toxic gossip train! Woo! I like that. That was cute. Today I'm icy, but I'm praying for some more snow. Now we have Colleen Ballinger High Trap Remix. I will accept. Ooh. Ooh. Give it to me. Oh. Hey. Oh. Okay, I'll take it. Okay, I'll take it. Okay, I'm taking it. Hey. Hey. Brought out the pink and the key. I hate when they switch it on me like that. I'm about to bust out the flow, but they switch it on me like that. Brought out the pink Lamborghini, just a race with China. Brought a race with China, just a race with China. Real back, Trini, bitch, and she mixed with China. Real pink vagina, brother, brick to China. Pull up in the monster, automobile gangsta With the bad bitch that came from Sri Lanka Down in the Tonka, color a Willy Wonka You can be the king, but watch the wig Okay, first things first I'll eat your brain Then I'ma start rocking goat teeth and things Cause that's what a motherfucking monster do He is dressing from Milan as a monster do That was probably the best ever killed, okay? That was probably the best ever killed it. You're welcome. You're welcome. Where's my Grammy? She doesn't even have a Grammy. She doesn't even have a Grammy. <gasps> I'm sorry, every time it happens, it gotta be fashion for a second. Today I'm icy, but I'm praying for some more snow. Little tear. We know it was a great attempt. We had fun. Okay, just a few more. This one's weird. Colleen Ballinger's apology, but I put it in mask over it. This one only has 97 views, so I'm kind of scared. Oh, Paris, this is hot. Oh, okay. That's a different song. Let's just play a different song. Eskers. Okay. Well, that's an F. Colleen Ballinger Apology Nightcore Remix. We already went through this. LinkedIn's Apology. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Not the filter. Ben. Oh my God. It's been a while since I saw my face. Oh no. A lot of people are saying some things about me that aren't quite true. No matter if it's true though, as long as it's entertaining to you. Okay, that's Kurt. Don't want to hear the rest of it, but I'm going to put it in the middle. Colleen Ballinger, Toxic Gossip Train Remix. There's fire. Ooh, flame. Ooh. Toxic Gossip Train, bitch. Gossip Train, bitch. That Toxic Gossip Train, bitch. That Toxic Train, bitch. Fuck me right. 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 Hey, 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 hey. 
Okay. okay. Bitches ain't got punchlines or flow, okay? It was cute, but the beat stayed the same the entire time. You got your click, and you got my attention. So be happy. Toxic Gossip Train 8-Bit Remix. Love it. Okay, love that. Give me brain like NYU. Give me brain like NYU. Yes, daddy, I do. Colleen Ballard's apology song, but every time she sings Toxic Gods Train, it speeds up. Toxic Gods Train, steamroll over someone's reputation. Toxic Gods Train, but the border closed eyes, otherwise you realize the train is realized, and that person who decides they didn't deserve to die, but hey, at least you're having fun. I hate that. Bitch, they got punchline or flow. And then finally, last but not least, Halloween Apology Trap Remix. All aboard the toxic gossip train. Train down the tracks of misinformation. Toxic gossip train. Climbing to the tracks and harassing for my past life. Okay, that's cute, but you've heard it before. 10 hundred times. No punchlines or flow. And there we go. Here is our Halloween Adjure by the Genadia Remix Tier List. Read it and we. Read it and we. Read it. You can't even read it, they're just pictures. But read it and wait. I'm not a pedophile. I just pay taxes. Flip. Now I got to the actual video now, right? That's what you guys want to hear. Okay, so my thoughts. Um, what the fuck? <laughs> my biggest problem is that it's such serious accusation to the point that even if they weren't true, to respond to that in a song felt so so toned up. Well, basically for her to sit there and just minimalize everything, call it all toxic gossip, and then be repeating over and over again, be like, oh, you guys are having fun? Oh, are you having fun? Are you having fun? Oh, do you care about that? No, you don't care about that, huh? Uh, okay, okay. Calm down. You're literally a full grown adult. She's also dismissing so many things that there, there are so many receipts and screenshots for. And she's saying things from, like years ago, when a lot of these screenshots that are coming out are from like 2021. She was only talking about certain things in the video and completely over jumping so many other things. Just so she can make a Point and just so she can get some clicks, girl. Doesn't the original video have like 13 million views now? Y'all did that. This entire situation is a very big example of the dangers and toxicity of certain parasocial relationships people grow with creators online. There has to be some shape of boundary between creators and viewers for the safety of both sides. I am very aware that you guys have more opportunity to see me than I do have opportunity to see you. So you guys probably feel more of a connection to me than I can possibly feel to you. And so because of that, I have to also become aware of the way I approach and talk to some viewers. I believe that is one of the places where Colleen dropped the ball. Even when I was making my Discord server, I was trying the best I can not to create some toxic relationship with people in the server that helped me build the server. But I feel like Colleen failed to establish that boundary with her viewers and also failed to understand the way her viewers see her. And because the way many of her viewers see her, it was probably hard when put in group chats like that and when she's chatting group chats like that for certain viewers to feel comfortable to possibly not respond to things she was saying or not agree to the things she was asking for. Like the one part of the video that I hate the most. I'm not a groomer, I'm just a loser. Girl, what? That to me is probably the most tone deaf part because girl, there are receipts. There are literal receipts. I feel like a lot of people, when they hear the word grooming, they simultaneously combine it with molestation or R.A.P.E. in the presses, in the media, on the social media, more recently than ever before. But the thing that a lot of people I feel like don't understand is that grooming doesn't always have to be sexual. Grooming is the practice of preparing or training someone for a particular purpose or activity. Utilizing your power over someone to corrupt them to do stuff that they otherwise would not do or feel comfortable doing on their own accord. Utilizing the fact that you are Colleen Ballinger, aka Miranda Singh, talking to a bunch of Colleen Ballinger and Miranda Singh's fans and getting them to bully your haters, talk about their personal information like their periods, or forcing them to give you advice and listen to you rant about your ex-husband. The conversation shouldn't be, I had nowhere to run to, so I ran to my fans. If you have nowhere to run to, do not run to a group of people who are going to say yes no matter what because they love you. That is when you cross the line into toxic behavior. This conversation that is happening about Colleen could possibly ricochet to other creators in the entire creator sphere. It is a form of manipulation because I find it very hard to believe that you as an adult do not understand the power you hold when you walk into a room full of people who love your character. Walk into chat rooms full of people who don't want to upset you, who don't want you to think badly of them and are going to do whatever they can to make sure that doesn't happen. And you walked into those groups, asked them about personal information, 
information. Forced them to listen to personal information about you. And even hired some of them to operate your social medias without pay? Okay. In the day and age where social media managers are making like 30K a year, Okay, girl. If there are not pre-established boundaries, parasocial relationships can get very dangerous for everyone. And her, as a full-grown adult, refusing to establish said boundary when she was in those group chats speaks volumes to me. And I really hope that she fully one day understands how toxic that is and fully admits that and apologizes for that specific reason. I love the people that watch my videos. You guys are the reason why I have food on my fucking plate, a roof over my goddamn head, and rent I can afford every fucking month. But at some point, both of us have to understand that we can only invest into each other to a certain degree. Especially me being the creator towards you. Because I don't know the vast majority of your faces. Boundaries are important for everyone. What did we learn today, kids? We, well, we learned what, what I just fucking said. I'm not repeating that. I would do a shout out on Twitter, but I just got the news that he's turning Twitter to something called X. And I don't, I'm tired. I might, we might move to threads, girl. Comment down below. Should I make this a normal thing? Take YouTubers apology video, find the remixes, and tier list the remixes? Because I'm fucking down. I'm fucking down, girl. And I'm gonna link every single remix that I react to in this description along with the tier list that I created and you guys can rate them yourself. Tweet at me your tier list. Thread me your tier list. Instagram me your tier list. I don't know. I am at Mac doesn't know everything girl. She's branded. My name is Mac and don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye.